Look, everyone. Isn't this a nice spot? No, Hen, not yet. Come on. It's just a little way. <laughs> just a little way. Hmm. Come on, follow me. What about here? It's shady and quiet. No, no. Not here. Come on, you'll see. Are we almost there? Oh, I'm ready for a nap. Almost. We're here. The lake. Oh, at last. This is the perfect spot for a picnic. Oh, and a nap. Oh. But we just got here. Let's go in the water. <laughs> Don't you want to come in? Not yet. In a while. Let's swim. It's fun. <laughs> For a fish. <laughs> or a bear. Come on, it's great. <laughs> it looks cold. It's not cold. It looks wet. It's not wet. Hey! No splashing. All right. I'll splash by myself. Hey! Ribbon. Ribbon. I got you, Frog. Hey, did you see that? See what? It's the mermaid. The mermaid? Yes. Didn't you see her? But she was just here. Just a second ago. You couldn't miss her. You're sure you didn't see her? I didn't. I didn't. What mermaid? Watch. Just watch. You'll see. Well? Well, she's there. I know it. Where? She's shy. Shy? She's afraid. Of what? Of us. She's afraid to come out with all of us here. Let's all go to sleep. But how will we see her if we all go to sleep? We just pretend to be asleep. And then she won't be afraid. Look at Father Bear. He's sleeping. Mother, will you close your eyes and pretend to be asleep? With pleasure. Good night. All right. Uh, I'll pretend to be asleep. Okay. Let's be quiet, and soon she'll be here. Thank you? <gasps> no. Want to swim? Yes. Where did 
Where'd you go? Over here. want to meet you. They're taking a nap. They won't mind waking up. I can't swim on the land. Won't they come in the lake? They're not swimmers. They're not? You're a wonderful swimmer. Oh, my. And you're the best swimmer of all. Thank you, little bear. I'd better go now. Goodbye. Father Bear. Bye. Little Bear, what are you doing? I thought we were supposed to be asleep. I saw the mermaid. Oh, really? I did. I swam with the mermaid. Oh, sure, Little Bear. You and your mermaid. Next time you see her, invite her to lunch. She might like a picnic. Come on, everyone. Of course, with a mermaid, you never can tell. That's the thing about mermaids. You never can tell. Time for lunch, little bear. <laughs> Surprise? Ah. Father, she didn't wake up. She'll be very surprised. What shall we make for Mother this morning? Muffins? No. Waffles? No. Hmm. Flapjacks? Uh-uh. What? Father Bear's famous flying flapjacks. Of course. You be the big chef, and I'll be the little chef. All right, little chef. Let's get to work. All set. Now, first the flower. Flower. Uh, uh, chew! More flour. More flour. Baking powder. Powder. Then the milk. Milk. Uh-oh. Now the egg. Egg. You first. Uh, 
How do you do that? It's all in the wrist, my son. You try it. You did it. I did it. A few little bits of shell in the batter won't hurt. Now stir it up. And stir. Let's set the table while the griddle gets hot. I'll get the flowers. Don't flip the flapjacks until I get back. Excuse me, bees. I only want a few of your flowers. Uh. Oh, hello, little bugs. You're good little bugs. No stingers, no thorns. Ugh. Father. Excellent. Splendid. Little chef, come and see. I see the bubbles. Yes, they must bubble just right, and then... Flip! Not yet. Flip! Flip! Not quite. Flip! Hurry! Flip! I'm flipping! I'm flipping! I think we flipped them just in time. Not a moment too soon. These look delicious. You try it. You did it! I did it! Get the platter all ready for landing, okay? Ready for takeoff? Ready. Ready for landing? Ready. One, two, three! three. <laughs> Perfect landing. Look at them fly! Hooray! <laughs> 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 Whoops. My goodness. Are rockets taking off in my kitchen this morning? Mother, look. We made breakfast for you. Oh, my favorite. Father's flying flapjacks. Some coffee, my dear? Thank you very much. Sit down, everybody. They're ready. They're hot. Oh, look. How lovely. I picked flowers for you. Thank you, little bear. And look at the bugs. What bugs? Look, the little bugs and the flowers. Uh-oh. I guess they like flapjacks, too? We'll let the little bugs eat this outside. You were both very smart to make an extra flapjack just for the bugs. Father was the big chef, and I was the little chef. Did we surprise you, Mother? I'm surprised and delighted. Here's to my two favorite chefs in the world. And to you. And to us. To the bugs. takes care of this one. Does this one go out too? Uh-huh. Are there any more up there, Father Bear? Here's another one. Little Bear, look. It's full of your baby clothes. I don't think these will fit me anymore. <laughs> no, definitely not. <laughs> no, I guess this box can go too. 
Oh, I haven't seen this in years. It's full of souvenirs from some of my trips. What are souvenirs? Mementos. Oh, my. Remember this? I sure do. You brought me this fan back from China. China? What a huge hat! It's a sombrero from Mexico. Are these some kind of shoes? Wooden shoes from Holland. Whoa! Oof. <gasps> wow! Look at these! What are these? Those are maracas. Oh. What are maracas? They're musical rattles. Oh. Father found those maracas on a faraway voyage, and he brought them home for me. When? It was a long time ago, before you were born, before Mother and I were married. Oh, my. to show my friends. Little Bear, take care with those. They're sentimental. Okay. What's sentimental? Oh, it's something you treasure. Treasure? <laughs> They're called maracas. Oh, how wonderful! Father Bear found them across the ocean a long time ago. Oh! A long, long time, even before we were born. Before we were born? Way back, when there were pirates. Pirates? Really? Oh, my! Mother said they were sentimental, and you know what that means. I do? No, I don't! Treasure. Pirates? Oh, no! Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. That's what Little Bear said. He said they were pirates. They came from Morocco. They were sandy and mental. Sandy and mental? The pirates? Yes, yes, the pirates! And Father Bear took their treasure. The pirates stole it, and Father Bear stole it back. Father Bear stole them from pirates? What else could he do? Did he use a sword or a saber? Sword or a saber? Sword or a saber? How would I know? Maybe both? Both? Both! Must have been both. Of course! Both! But I bet those pirates are mad. Uh-oh. A sword and a saber? How many pirates did Father Bear fight? A dozen, at least. A dozen? Maybe a hundred. But Father Bear won. He won the treasure. Those pirates are bound to come back. Do you really think so? Oh, yes. They were mad. What should we do? Little Bear, didn't Mother tell you to take care of her maracas? Yes. Didn't she say they were special? I thought they were special, too. That's why I showed them to Duck. And where are they now? I know I can find them. I know they're not lost. If they're lost, then Mother will be upset. We better go find them. We'll go look for Duck, and we'll look for Hen, and hopefully... What is going on? 
Are you all right, Father Bear? Are we too late? Did the pirates come? What pirates? We knew they'd be back for the treasure. We knew they'd be mad. We wanted to help. <laughs> we brought you a sword. A sword? For me? Can I have a sword? Here's one for you. Thanks. On guard. Can we help Father Bear? Can we help you to fight the pirates? Well, uh, yes. Sure, I can always use your help. Those pirates are no match for you. But first, has anyone here seen Mother Bear's special maracas? I gave them to Hen. <laughs> I gave them to Owl. Hmm. I gave them to Cat. Where is Cat? Look! Look! Look at Mother! Look! Mother found her maracas! But I'm still a little confused. <laughs> you never told me you fought off a hundred sentimental Moroccan pirates just to bring back this treasure to me. I did? I heard it from Cat, who heard it from Owl, who heard it from Hen, who heard it from Duck. Ah, of course. Only a hundred? Gosh, it seemed like more. 